And um, I kept it a secret. I, I judged myself. I didn't want people to know. Um, I thought I was less than. Megan McCann here, founder of Soul Success and the host of the Soul Success online summit where we are talking about alchemy turning piles of shit into nuggets of gold sarah has been featured on the oprah winfrey show good morning america the view fox chicago npr someone else's life so um it was just really innate reaction on what how are we going to survive this with survivors and their families can relate to what I'm saying and automatically understand what I'm talking about. I've paid attention to for a long time. And honestly, I don't know if it was until writing this chapter for your book that I really dug deeper and said, what, what is the link between some of these childhood traumas and earning? Mm -hmm. So it's not just that you put your shoes there and then you go chill. It's that you go live there. You build a house there. You're like, this is where I'm fucking living. Um, really impactful. But then when you become a mom and you can really step into the shoes of a mom and take a mom's perspective, it impacts you on a whole new level. And, and I don't know of a better topic to discuss right now during this crazy time. I know a lot of us might be going through uncertainty. We might be going through our own personal battles at home and dealing with this new normal that we're living in. And as you were reading it, it was like, whew. I still held my breath a little bit. So. Take in the positive and exhale the pain. June 12th, our book, Soul Success, will be released out, available on Amazon and in paperback. We're going to get a behind-the-scenes look into the real, the raw stories behind these women and the struggles they've had to overcome, the lessons they've learned, and the tools they implemented to come out on top. I promise you, you will not be disappointed. These women are going to tug at your heartstrings. It's already causing me to just go right back to that moment of writing it. Um, it's making me emotional just even saying it and reading it to me because it's such like this, what you read in the beginning intro of, of acknowledging myself for, for what I've done and then, and then at the same time, diving right into the adversity that actually propelled me into that is like this, it's just, it, it's just like the soul wrenching thing that happens when I hear you do that. I don't know. I don't know if that makes sense, but I want people to know that they're not alone. And that's what this book embodies is locking arms and showing that we rise to greater heights when we can share our truth and rise together.